Hey guys, what's up? Nate Rio here again. Uh, welcome back. So for day two here as to what did Nate learn working with Matt Lloyd, uh, the CEO of Mobe, my own business education. Uh, again, uh, day one we covered, you know, um, what does it take to uh, make it in this business and it was get rid of all the distractions and do the simple things. Remember, we drew that line from point A to point B. It's not to take the curvy, windy road. It's to go you know, straight from point A to point B. It's not focus on all the other noise. It's find a good offer and to just get traffic and send it to that offer. That's your only, the only thing you need to focus on. So, so for day two, uh, here's the second thing that I learned from working with Matt. So again, just to recap, um, so Matt Lloyd here at, at my own business education, Mob, as uh, is responsible for paying out over sixty million dollars in commission to its affiliate partners, and uh, the company has earned over one hundred twenty million dollars. So um, if there's a model that works, it is this model. Um, those are real numbers. I can show it to you. I'm the affiliate manager. But anyway, let's get into step two. All right. So step two as to what did I learn from my experience here from working with the CEO, Mo Matt Lloyd? Well, um, this one's actually pretty easy too. It's, um, you may have heard of the slogan, it's called Ready, Fire, Aim. All right, now I know a lot of you are like, wait a minute, isn't it Ready, Aim, Fire? Well, no, in this instance, it's called Ready, Fire, Aim. So uh, let me give you an example. Let's say you have an idea, you see something that works and you're like, oh, you know, like, oh, this Facebook ad is working and, oh, I can see how they built this page and I may not know how to do it, but I, but I understand it. You know, you put your email address in and you go through their funnel, you get to their order page and you see, hey, they're, they're selling the same thing that I'm selling. They're another affiliate partner in this same program. I could do that too. You, you realize, well, I was on Facebook and I, you know, I clicked an ad and then I went to this page and then I went to this page and then this page and, the, and, and then they want me to buy. All right. So all you need to do is you need to copy that. Now, don't copy them exactly, but look at what they've done and get it done. So you're ready. And it, it, instead of making all these excuses, now this is the difference between the aim and the fire. The aim would be the planning, right? So you, you're ready, you're going to aim, and then you're going to pull the trigger. Well, what you're going to do in this case is you're not going to worry about that. You're just going to go get the dang thing done. Okay. So seriously, you see something, find a way to get it done. All right. Um, Mobe does that like crazy. If you guys haven't noticed, um, we say we're going to put out a product in you know, two or three, four days a week or whatever. And we put it out, you know, um, Matt doesn't care if it's not perfect. He just puts it out and then we, we deal, we pick up the slack later because the sooner you get it out, the sooner stuff happens. Because you see, and here's the thing with people, if you haven't noticed, we're natural procrastinators. Everybody's a procrastinator to some, to some point. So you're thinking, well, I'm the biggest procrastinator. Um, probably not. Uh, the, the thing is, successful people, they've learned to hone their, hone their skills and, and understand their weaknesses. And they're comfortable at being uncomfortable. And they can blow right through that. So in, instead of just procrastinating for the sake of procrastinating, they, they tell people and they hold themselves accountable. Okay. So for instance, if you said, well, I understand this funnel, I understand that Facebook is bringing me to this page and this offer and I, you know, et cetera, et cetera. What they'll do is they say, okay, I need to get this done by X date because this needs to go live. So what do you do? You tell some friends, you tell some family and say, Hey guys, you tell your emails and say, guys, I'm, I'm giving you this amazing offer. There's something crazy that's coming out. I'm going to put it into action and then you do it. What if you don't know how? And you know what? There's going to be stuff you're not going to know how to do. If you haven't figured that out yet, well, you're in for a, a very rude awakening, okay? Um, there's tons of stuff you're not going to know how to do. Find somebody to get it done, all right? So uh, the number two lesson, and I, I hope you're kind of you know following me on this, is just when you see something that you like, ready fire and aim, you know, just do it right away. So the key is the, from the ready to the fire, you know, we can figure out, you know, locking it in, locking in our sights a little bit later. Okay. So when you see something that you like and you know that that works and you can see somebody having those successful results, just go and get it done. And you need to focus, laser focus on that activity until you get it done. So that is the end of the second thing that I've learned. That's day two. So we have one more day. This is really, really important. I'm going to kind of tie all this together that we learned uh, from day one and day two. So 
go ahead, meet me back here tomorrow, and uh, we'll pick up this conversation. And uh, that's about it for today. I'll talk to you soon. All right, take care.